Hello, we're on Amherst, Massachusetts, and we're right on the South Amherst Green, looking towards the east, and this is South Congregational Church. And a good time to be here because it's 200 year anniversary of the church itself. It's a uh, parish was formed in 1824. This church was built the next year. And they're celebrating thus their 200th year of existence of their congregation in the year 2024. Now, sadly, if you had come out here last year, the steeple would have been intact. They took it off and they're repairing it and they'll put it back. <laughs> Um, but so sadly you don't get quite the look you're supposed to be getting but they're a uh, fine parish they've been here stabilizing the green and all the very many uh, families that lived around here institutions that have been around here and they have a very active social agenda their social hall is towards the back and they have a speaker series um, and it goes by the name of uh, United Church of Christ also. It also goes by South Church of Amherst. Uh, South Amherst Church. A lot of different names. Now, what do they have? Or what is this? This is, it looks almost like a federal style building. I don't, I don't know if it really is. But it has a very nice look to it. Now, it's, it's a campus that has a rectory, so we're going to look across the street. And this is the rectory right here. Um, and it, it almost certainly has been the whole time. And look at the way it's positioned right towards the church. They made sure that it was very close on the hand. Of course, it wasn't quite as busy um, in the past with, with passenger vehicles going by. Now, this is still the rectory, so, and I found it on maps in the 1870s that it was a rectory, and there are sources say that it wasn't a rectory for a while, but I, I doubt that it was a rectory in the 1870s for sure, and it still is. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to look at a few things around here. Right next to it is the Munson Memorial Library, a satellite library of the Amherst uh, Public Library System, and we're, we're going to be having a tour here soon. And what are we going to see? We're going to see lots of very important points around this area, including the green itself. And the green is in the triangle form of, with one road cutting through it. And it used to have a school right on the edge of that far, uh, far street. And then in the distance this way, you see a very important house with a barn below uh, beyond it. That's that farm uh, is probably the oldest home on this green. It's one of, it's a Dickinson home, but there's so many Dickinson member family or family members in the area that it's probably not related to Emily Dickinson directly at all. And then his son moved in right next door to it and left. And so you get what you got. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish off with a 360 for you.